Oh, look at that bass. The smallest crawl I have ever seen. Oh my gosh. I hope everybody's having an amazing day. Welcome to another video. If you guys are new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell also. Hit the like button if you've been enjoying the content. I got three guests on today's episode. I think you guys are gonna enjoy this one. Let me show you who I got with me. We got the man, the myth, the legend, First State Fishing right here. What you guys wanna up, go check him out, you can go check him out down below. We got my boy, What's Fletcher, poppin'? right here. If you guys wanna check out Fletcher's channel, you already know him, down below. And this weirdo over here, What's Mr. Up? What's Ada. Up? Me up. Me up. Mr. Yes, Mr. Ada Fishing. If you guys wanna check out their channels, you know where to find them, in the description box down below. <laughs> <laughs> the birds are chirping. It's a beautiful day outside. We're gonna go catch them. Dude, look at this man's like. Hold up. Dude, look. Dude, he's literally putting his all in it. I think he wants you now. <laughs> Oh, uh, come on. So let's just ignore the birds. We're gonna go ahead. <laughs> I just love people. So let's ignore the birds, the cars, the, the wildlife. We're gonna go ahead and get inside of Walmart. We're gonna talk about what we're doing today. If you guys wanna see some more challenges like this, please let me know. Some video ideas in the comment section down below. This is gonna be a banger. Let's get it started. Mike, what it, what is that, bro? Some South Carolina stuff right there, dude. Some South Carolina? You know, mud in their Hyundai <laughs> dance, bro. Somebody's in there sleeping, dude, and you just filmed them. Wait, Are you serious? I'm so sorry. I did not. Did, was it really? Was it really? <laughs> they went laid back in the seat. I was just telling Fletcher that, and then you're sitting there filming the car. I was like, you literally Wait, did, what, did his eyes open? I don't know if they did or not. I guess we'll check yeah, on the... Wake up? <laughs> we'll, we'll check on the footage later, but... Four dudes, one camera. <laughs> Are you ready to catch a big fish today? Ooh, I heard that there's some big fish around in South Carolina so I think we're gonna get them dude like PB action we tried it last time oh, yeah. but we're making it happen this time right oh, dude, we're gonna make it happen speak it into existence bro you know why you Is know that, why we're gonna catch them what is it we, we got the big bass energy today yeah, I know I know I know we haven't talked about the big bass energy Mike but we got <laughs> we got the big bass energy you know we got we got the positive attitude we're going into it we got the confidence yeah, we're gonna catch them today. I just feel it in the air. We're gonna, you, you just feel it. You feel it with the birds chirping, the cars revving, the guys sleeping in the cars. <laughs> it's gonna be a good day. What is it? It's got a, a disgorger. What? <laughs> That's interesting. I don't know what that means. So boys, we just made it inside of Walmart. <laughs> got the old boys right here. They have a pretty big fishing section in here, and, and it's like half salt water, half fresh water. But I think today what we're gonna be doing is fishing with the world's smallest crawl. I saw something in here literally probably eight months ago, and I was like, I wanna come back in the Walmart, I wanna get it and make a video on it. This is gonna be a freaking banger. Like I said, check out the boys' channels. Let me show you guys what I'm talking about. So you know they have all the soft plastics right here. They got, you know, some fluke style baits, some swim baits, some paddle tails. They got some, you know, regular worms. They got some crawls, they got some lizards. But there is one crawl in here, guys, that is gonna blow your mind when I, when I show you. I don't know if you've seen it before, but it's this one right here. Little, now hold this up to the camera. Dude. Look at that little mini dude right there. Hold on. There, let me, let me, uh, 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 oh, uh oh, oh, he's got, got him. We got him. We got him. We got him. <laughs> All right, boys, I'm back. I just got caught, but I'm, I'm back now. I got out of the net, got unhooked. We got this little, little crawl daddy right here. Dude, that is the little smallest. Crawl daddy's gonna get eaten. All right, can we confirm that that is 100% the world's smallest crawl? I mean, I, I mean, it looks like a little baby. It just I mean, came out. This is it next to my finger. Hold on, I mean, let, me, let me let me focus. He's really being there. We go. I mean, look at it next to my finger, dude. It's that is so small, so tiny. It's like an inch, like max. Not an inch. not even an inch, dude. That's like literally. That's this. Uh, yeah, I wonder maybe. If it says. I mean, that <laughs> jig is bigger than that. Like <laughs> yeah, literally, the jig. That's is. a tiny little jig, and it makes that bait. Like Look honestly, good. the one thing I'm worried about is like, is the bass gonna be able to get hooked because the hook is so small? And also, you can't put it on a big hook. the tackle that we're gonna have to throw it on, that's gonna be very it's important. Be very, Another very thing light. is, 
How much is this? How, how much are these? One sixteen. They're only a dollar sixteen. There's only two in a pack, so don't you think we should probably buy two to three packs? Correct. Definitely. So let's look. Clear them out. We're, we're clearing it. Do they have any other colors? We're clearing it, boy. Colors? This is the only color, sadly. Um, actually, I saw some more. See, there's some right there. I think that's the same color, though. Are they all the same? See, the one thing you could do to change up the color if you really wanted to is buy some different colored jig heads. Yeah, really, you could. That's I what I was know. saying. You want to look at the jig heads, see what they got? Let's look at. Let's look and see if they got anything. Right here, right here. Oh, there they are. I just don't know if they have small enough, bro, to be honest with so you. These are chartreuse, but I mean, they don't. All yeah. these are so big. This is like the smallest thing they have right here. I think we can go. I think we can work with it. We have three in there. I think that's going to be fine, don't you? I, I maybe get like just the smallest ones you can. Like, I mean, maybe they have these. these. These just don't have paint, though. They're just normal, just lead. I mean, oh, I would get for backups. For ba Let's get it. This is yeah. $1.96. I think it's worth the investment. This whole total is just going to be like $6. Walmart! What, what are you doing? <laughs> they are restocking the entire Walmart behind <laughs> like us. Magnet. Bro, I don't know. They're wrestling back there or something. <laughs> I mean, literally, Got some w the whole wall is shaking over here. W -W Look at that, dude. All these baits are shaking. Hello! Oh my god. <laughs> no, you didn't. Bro, his, head, his head was right there. <laughs> All right, can we go? Anyways, guys, we're, we're <laughs> let's go. Come on, <laughs> please, just come on. We, we got to get out of here. I think we got the tackle that we need. Jeez, all right. All right, the Walmart is falling. Apart. You know what's funny is is outside it was cars, it was birds, and now it's just like. Yeah, I respect the grind though. They grind it right. They they getting the work done. All right, boys, come on. Taking you with, let's go. <laughs> so we just got out to the beautiful lake. We're about to put in this clear water one. We've been fishing it recently. Got the boys right there. And uh, I was gonna film a little segment before we even get this started. We were just talking about it. It's really windy um, right now. It's, it's perfect for just pure fishing right now. And of course I'm throwing this tiny little just baby crawl. Of course on this like the best day for fishing. Got a little spinning rod, thanks to Fletcher. I didn't have one with me because I will not throw that little thing on the baitcaster. That would not work. Yeah, let's go ahead and take this thing out. And I kind of want to see how we're going to rig this up. So, you know, each one of them has two of the little crawls in there and one little jig head. Let's go ahead and pop this guy open real quick. Look how small that is. Look how freaking small that is. Look, look at this. Just lay it in my hand real quick. Guys, that is so small. That is by far the smallest crawl I have ever seen, and I'm pretty sure that's probably the most detailed and smallest crawl out there, hands down. So if we were to do this, we're gonna rig it through the bootox right there, have the crawls hanging off the end just like that, and uh, let's, let's see what we can do. Push you on up there, yeah. Look at that right there. Look at that, dude. What you think about that, Fletcher? I think that's gonna get munched. Dude, that's just like, I mean. I mean, it's just a baby little crawl. It's just a baby crawl. It's just so windy today, man. I'm just worried about that, like just kind of getting it out there. But, you know, we got that right there. It's on braid. Got a four carbon leader tied from a uni to uni knot. And uh, yeah, we're gonna tie this thing on. Me and First State are gonna be on the boat today. Adam and Fletcher are gonna be on the boat. So if you guys wanna see their perspectives, Make sure you check them out. But anyways, hit that like button. Let's go ahead and hop on the water and see what the world's smallest crawl can catch. So we had some technical So we had some technical difficulties. I went to go cast this crawl and guys, I could get it a solid five foot away from me. So we thought outside of the box. We rigged it up on a drop shot right here. And as you can tell, it's nose hooked, but also weedless at the same time. Yes, it doesn't look like much. And yes, the bait is smaller than the hook, but guess what? We're still gonna catch them today. I'm excited about it. And uh, we're gonna see what today holds. Me and First State about to hop on the boat. We'll catch you there. All right, you ready? You ready to get it now? He's doing his little challenge. I'm doing mine. Let's, let's see what the heck we can do. I wanna start in this corner. This spot right here has got a good bit of rock. There's usually a fish or two that, you know, hang on this. I guess we'll see though. And then we can go to like the juice offshore spot. We might need to just go out to the juice spot. I think that's, I think that's the deal. They've been on that stuff really good, the offshore stuff. Right here. So you just want to cast towards that buoy. If you cast to the left-hand side of it, there's some chunk rock, some smaller chunk rock. On the right-hand side of it, there's some bigger pipes. Yeah. So just start. We're going to work our way in. We don't want to go on top of it. So we're just going to – you might not be able to reach it from here, but we're going to just ease ourselves in. 
But if there's one or two here, there's gonna be more. So just get ready. Don't be surprised if you get that rod taken out of your hand quick. No, uh no, uh yes, oh, dude. yes. Bro, that's a decent... Oh my god, is it a good one? Oh my god, dude, he's toting the boat. Oh my god, yo, dude, I'm gonna help you land it. I'm gonna help you land it. Oh, 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 oh. Dude, it's like a, it's like a three and a half pounder. A oh, oh yeah. dude. <laughs> give me some, man. Yeah, that was good. good. Dude. Well, guys, first date, like I said, I'm not gonna show all the fish catches. You know, you guys need to go check it out on his channel, but. He just landed a very, very great fish. Right off the bat, this spot's been holding fish really good lately, and that is just awesome right there. I'm just curious if they're gonna eat this little crawl. I'm very curious, I guess we're gonna find out. Usually if they're on, no way, next cast? I told you they're going to <laughs> See, they're loaded, bro. I'm telling you, this spot, that fish is a little bigger than the last. Yeah, he looks a little thicker. That's a, that's a fat bass. Hey, look, I want you to look. See see the pipes? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, that was a bite. He might he might come back. Uh oh, uh oh. Dude, it's not hooking him for some reason. What in the world is so freaking small, bro? Dude, he bit me twice. Do you think he took it off? No, he's right there. Look, he messed it up though. Oh, that was my first bite on the freaking world's smallest crawl right there. Two bites in a row. Like I said, this these fish get on these pipes and stuff really good. When, when they're on it, they're on it. It's just unbelievable. The last week has just been spectacular before they weren't on this stuff. So it's just awesome to see. It's awesome to see it. Oh my God, look at that gator. Look at that gator. Dude, that is like a 10 footer right there. Look at his head. That's his head. Bro, that thing is not jumping up here. He's too big. Yo, they can climb fences. He would just eat the boat. He, he wouldn't even. Oh, look at that bass. Oh my gosh, Where? dude. That was a giant bass right there. That was like a four or five pounder. Just. Oh, you guys stop scaring me with this. Oh my God. <laughs> Well, guys, we're about to run some magic. This is, we've been out here for a very long time, and I cannot catch a fish on this dang thing. We're going to try something. And I think it might work. We're going to take a piece of this trick worm, and we have a net head right here. We're going to rig it up on the net head and use it as a base. Okay? Just like that. And then we're going to rig this off the back of it. I think that's like our only hope. This thing's so small, unless we're fishing for like crappie or bluegill or whatever it is. I just don't see it happening with this thing. This has been a tough little experiment here, not gonna lie. All right guys, so we got our little rig. I know it's not exactly what was it, like advertised on the package of the bait, but like I said, man, we, we like it's just so small. We, we gotta do something. Um, we got we got to do something so we're gonna give it a shot oh my god yeah that's very light <laughs> and guys it is windy as all can be i know i have a mic on my gopro and you guys always are like no way it is not wind whoa i cannot cast this i gotta do it overhand but it is very windy today it is freaking blazing there we go yeah i think we're gonna catch one on this actually watch this first date i feel it i feel it bro I feel it too, man. it's that big bass energy it's that big bass energy bro I just want to know that I can catch one on this. That's all I want to know. Is that a fish will actually eat this little turd. That was a fish, bro. <gasps> oh! 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 What the heck just happened, dude? I saw a giant freaking... Bro. Hey. That was a freaking five pounder, bro. Did you see it? I saw it. You'll see it on my GoPro. It was that clear. On the freaking tit. The tit. <laughs> on the turd, bro. That fish was so big. He bit it though, right? Dude, he, had, he ate it. So he missed it at first. And, I, and he literally came back. There was another one. And he ate it. And I hook set and it just didn't stick him, bro. That was a five pounder. Well guys, if you don't know what just happened, I'm sorry for freaking out. I, that, I literally almost had a heart attack. I looked down and there's like a freaking three, four pounder trying to eat it. And then like a five pounder came out of nowhere and swallowed it. And I just didn't get him hooked for some reason. I have no idea why. I, I, I don't understand, but that was crazy. And I'm praying that you guys could see that first fish. 
He was like three to four pounds and it was clear as day. I'm pretty sure you guys could see that. Guys, please hit that like button. This has been a struggle. The struggle is real. And look at the wind blowing us. <laughs> I got him, I got him, I got him. Oh my gosh. Oh, he's actually a good one, dude. Oh, yes. I've been waiting so long for this. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited, dude. I was calling that. Don't come off, baby. It's actually a pretty good fish, too. It's like a two and a half pounder. All right, baby. Just stay pinned. Stay pinned. Please stay pinned. Mm. <laughs> mm. Mike, I've been waiting so long. You know, you, you witnessed this. This was the most painful thing ever, but it actually happened. So we tried a ton of different rigs, guys. And that little turd rig was what worked right there. And uh, you know, it, like I said, it didn't look the most appetizing, but that is a beautiful fish right there. Solid two pounder. Oh man, I, look at, just look how beautiful and chunky that these fish are. Just like, they're just filled out, you know? They're not skinny on one side, none of that. Just beautiful fish. Beautiful audio in the background. I know, dude, what the heck? <laughs> <laughs> All right. I think she's just like a two and a quarter. I don't think she's a two and a half. She's about a two pounder. Two four two. Two four two. Yep. Two four. Okay, I'll show you guys. I already know people are gonna. Yeah. Two four two. <laughs> people be like, no, that is not a two four two. <laughs> well, that's a. It's a pretty fish. Let's yeah. just get her right back in the water, guys. That feels so good after literally watching Mike over here just spank <laughs> my butt on these delicious Walmart baits, and I'm throwing a little turd bait. But uh, it, oh man, that that just feels so good. It's so rewarding, and we're gonna get back in there and catch another one. Oh yeah, that's, that's what good, we're talking dude. about, brother. <laughs> we missed a four or five pounder at the beginning, but that's not holding us back. We're gonna get back in there, catch another one. They're freaking in this corner. Oh my god, dude! I'm telling you, they're freaking loaded. <laughs> no way, dude! After all this. After all of this, about a pound and a half. Dude, we found the freaking honey hole and they're loaded in there. We're gonna keep catching them. Oh, baby, no, don't come off. Don't, no, 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 whoop, yep, whoop. <laughs> Look at the markings on this bass, guys. Beautiful fish. Dude, that feels so good, bro. That, that's crazy. Is that not crazy? Tell the people, man, just like about fishing, like how your day can like turn. Amen. And like, if anything deserves a like, is this video. <laughs> this dude is playing with a freaking cast that thing. Oh man, that, that is awesome, dude. That is so cool. All right, beautiful fish. We're gonna get him right back. They're in this corner, guys. I'm having a ton of bites. They're just not getting it all the way. Hopefully they're different fish and they're not just this one, but I think there's a lot of fish in there. Or it was th just this guy the whole time. Remember when I said he was about a pound? <laughs> <laughs> it's this guy the whole time that's bit, bit me. No. no. Oh. Log. <laughs> you got me excited, Mike. Look, he bent out the hook, bro. Oh, yeah. You see that? Dude, those hooks are trash. Yeah. Dang it, Fletcher. See what Fletcher tried to do? I know they're on the other John boat. They're filming a different video, but Fletcher was like, you know what? We're just going to mess with Noah today. Maybe that fish is still right here. Maybe more of them. Dude, that's a good one. That's a big one. Dude, that's a big one. Uh, I can't tell. It might be one of them. I'm gonna back us off. There's multiple. Dude, this is a big fish. That's that's. Oh my gosh. Dude, that's like a, that's four pounder. Dude, let's go. That's a freaking big fish, bro. That's almost a four pounder. I don't think he's quite four, but he's almost a four pounder, dude. Guys, we went back to right where I missed those big ones and just hooked this freaking dinosaur right here. This is about a three pound fish. I don't think he's quite four. This might've been the one I missed at the beginning when I said there was a three and a five pounder. And that is a freaking big bass right there. Oh my gosh. I don't think he's pushing four, but he's, he's high threes. He's a hundred percent high threes. Let's get a weight on this guy. 396, bro. Oh, 392. Almost. Good. All right. We're just going to call him. Right, we can't call him a four, but pretty much a four pounder, dude. That is a beautiful fish. <laughs> All right, guys. We're going to get this beautiful bass back in the water. Four pounder. That is what we're talking about. 
on a bait this small. That shows you, big bass will still eat small baits. Look at that, that's a pancake. <laughs> Straight freaking pancake. Oh man. Four pounder. She's ready. Let's dude, go, let's dude. go! <laughs> that was so good. <laughs> that is exactly what we needed today. Please hit that like button. We've been grinding today, guys. Let's get back in there.